although uh, there had been some molecules detected in space in the 1940s, it wasn't really until around 1970 that the field started. And uh, molecules were observed in, in various regions in, in space. And uh, the, the uh, first perhaps 10 to 15 years, uh, people were just excited by the fact that they had seen molecules. And so more and more molecules were seen. But eventually, in the last, say, 20 years or so, the field has evolved. And now people are still interested in what molecules can be seen in, in space, but uh, also interested in what the molecules tell us about, uh, say, physical conditions in space. So molecules are an excellent probe of, of, of physical conditions. So we learn what the temperatures are and what the pressures are uh, of, of various regions in, in, in the universe. Now, we also learn about, uh, about chemistry, and what, how complex molecules can be made. And that is, of course, very important in understanding uh, what happens during the formation of stars and planets. Because after all, uh, complex molecules do exist on Earth <laughs> and presumably many other planets. And so we'd like to know uh, what, mole what molecules are there, how are they formed, and what they have to do with uh, the, uh, the, the molecules that are on Earth and other planets uh, now. So the, the uh, astrochemistry, as we now call it, is, has become a much bigger field in which uh, there are many people who are interested. There are people interested in astronomy because molecules are probes of uh, the physical conditions, as I mentioned. There, uh, there, there are people interested in the chemistry, how these molecules are formed in very unusual conditions by the, what we're used to on the present day Earth. And there are people also interested in, 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 the, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the physics, the, the physical processes that, uh, that, that molecules undergo. And so we, 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 we learn a, a lot about many different fields. And so this field in the last 20 years has grown bigger and bigger. And uh, when we first started the meetings, they were quite small. And now, as you can see, we are up to uh, 450 people and many more who tried to come and, and couldn't because there wasn't room for them. When I, when I started as a, as a student, a PhD student, there were perhaps a handful of people who were interested in this field. And so it has grown explosively, especially in the last 20 years. And now with new telescopes coming, uh, very much more powerful than previous telescopes, the field is going to uh, become even, even bigger. And it, it, may be, it certainly will become a major aspect of, of astronomy and maybe even of chemistry.